Welcome back to the shit show. <laughs> We're making dinner tonight, but first, we need anti. Crack you open a cool one. Just kidding. Oh, I'm that was a bad oh. run. Yeah, we need some freaking energy, okay? I started a new job. I need some freaking energy. I'm running on fumes right now. No, why not? Monster. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There we go. Monster. Original. And I got me a pomegranate wrap Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cheers it. Drink. Duh. Anyway, let's see if the chicken is defrosted. Well, let me tell you guys. So do that. Let me tell you what we're making. We're having. I'm going to have to put it in the microwave. Wow. Microwave. Microwave. Yeah. Because I gotta let it defrost a little bit more, better than that, it'd be alright. One thing. We're having. Fried chicken legs, fried chicken, fried chicken legs, and what is that? Corn and mashed taters. And mashed taters. I'm also. While you're talking to them. I'm gonna put up these dishes. Okay. Okay, my friend. Okay. Okay. I'm also gonna. I'm gonna make tea. Sometime. Actually, I'm gonna cut while you do that just so we don't hear the bang playing. Me back. Okay, guys. I'm deciding to open in these windows. You like our peacocks? My, my peacock. Anyway. Not that kind of peacock. But I'm opening up these windows. Bring some light in here. She's getting potatoes started for mashed taters. Excuse me. And she's burping. Okay. There's that. Oh! Let me update you guys. Let me move my drink and I'll sit over here and update you guys real quick. So. Ugh. You're okay, my friend. We have to take trash out, we know. Right. Babe's back there on the percussions. Damn straight. And I'm not straight. <laughs> but, here's the update. She got into... My eyes look cool right now. Anyway, she got a job. She's now working at Hardy's. There's a story with that, and I'll get into that in a little bit. Or do you want to tell it? What story? Oh, no, you can tell them. Okay. I'll tell you that in a little bit. Let me just... What story you talking about? Let me just get the main points out, and I'll go back into detail. We're not a sponsor by any brand shown in this video. Mind if... Any monster or rebel wants to sponsor us? Let me know. Just let me know. But we're gonna oh next contract. She got a job at Hardy's. Um I'm just at my current job. Um I don't have any clients and our cat is now allowed in our apartment. So let me go from easiest to talk about to more to talk about. Easiest to talk about was work. I was with the client. I'm not gonna go into too much detail about it because I can't. But she it became a toxic environment with threatening involved. So I got relocated to a client like five minutes down the road from me, and he is. 
me best. He's awesome. Me and him get along great. And with that, I may have a new job opportunity coming up because if his insurance can get him off the waiting list, and we're going to see if we can pull a few strings on that, but if um, they can, then we're going to try to get me in with him. I'm already Monday through Friday, 9 and 2. We're going to try to get me 8 hours a day, and then that will be a pay increase. And will be really nice. Um, so that's what we're looking into right now for my job. Another quick thing. The cat's allowed. We took Jasmine. Jasmine is our cat if you don't know. I'm sure she may show up in this video sometime. But it's her white ragamuffin cat named Jasmine. And we got her probably like March wouldn't you say? Yeah. Okay, around March. And she already had her shot. She was an ex breeder cat and then an old lady, or an older lady had her. And we got her from her for free. All fixed, you know, Jasmine's ready to go. Okay, great. We thought we had the right paperwork we needed. And we were just waiting for my apartment to approve what they needed to do, which took months. And finally like, okay, we got it together and we're like Okay, right, here's the paperwork. Great, great, done deal. Eh, wrong. <laughs> Not done deal. Wrong paperwork, apparently, and you have to prove that. And the cat I'm bringing in is the cat on the paperwork, and it was a whole roundabout. They were mad that I don't have to pay the cat fee type of a deal. So, I digress. We got her shot, so we went to a new vet. I haven't even been to this vet before with my past pets. But, we took her there. That's really nice. Um, everyone's really nice. Except for, they had an inside cat named Duchess. And she was rude. She was trying to play. But that girl's got some claws. Let me tell you. So I distracted her with my keychain. But all in all, she went well. Jasmine took the shots like a champ, didn't holler, didn't scream or nothing. She didn't like being in her carrier that long. She went meow, meow, meow all the time. So, there's that. But, needless to say, she's all shot. Shot. Wow. Great. <laughs> Great choice of words. She has all of her shots. And she's now free to roam in the house all around like she wants. Um, we're keeping, I don't know if I can talk on here, nope. Okay, I'll show you later when I go in the kitchen. But kitchen is, we are keeping the laundry room doors shut more. Even when they're running, we're pretty much just opening them if we have to get something in or out. But other than that, we're getting them shut. There's nothing back there that could hurt her, per se. And it's just the water heater and the furnace and, I don't know. I just don't want her back there, so I don't leave the doors open. But she's been a cuddle butt in our room. Her fur is everywhere, so I had to really... I brushed out a lot, but um, I was... when Last weekend, we were like, no, we got a vacuum, and we got the brusher brusher. So I put her back in the guest room where she was, and I uh, brushed her brusher until she was not happy. I'm like, I'm so over being brushed right now. And we did that. And I was going to trim her nails, but I'm going to need some backup for that. So we're going to call in our mom, Maggie. And mom's going to help me with that. And, um, so yeah. I'll show you some of the things I set up for Jasmine. Teddy. I don't think they've seen Teddy since we built the Great Wall of Teddy, have they? We built a great wall of Teddy. I'll explain it. It's getting renovated soon, so I do not want any white trash comments. Because I know I just threw it together. But we don't have to talk about that. Okay? Okay. Thank you. But. Oh, and we, we changed our whole room up. We'll have to give you guys a tour. No, I know we showed you the apartment. But we changed the whole room. So. Yeah. There's that. Oh, baby job. 
So Ben finds a job now. She works at Hardee's, and here's how the story goes. They were so impressed by her burping skills that they just hired her, you know? She burped in the drive thru and was like, I need her on my team. Right, babe? No. A half of us is we haven't been having like a Hardy's breakfast in forever. And you know, one day I had to already go in town for filling up paper for work. And I'm like, hey, you wanna grab some Hardy's? We haven't had some in forever. You know, let's do it. So we go. We get some Hardy's and we notice um it was it was a little slow, you know. But it is what it is. We weren't complaining or nothing. We just noticed that it was going pretty slow. And then there was this older lady working and she said, Yeah, I'm the only one here up front. There was she didn't say in the back, but it looked like really there was only two people there. To run a whole morning shift. So we're like, ooh, interesting. So, and you guys know from our mukbangs, sometimes Jess and I will either take our food home, but a lot of times we will um, sit in the parking lot and just have kind of like a lunch date or something like that. So we were, we saw the sign that, um, that when they're hiring sign. And this is like, you know what? Let's do it. I need a job. They need people to have a job. Let's do it. And we get all applied. She actually had an interview the day of and got hired on the spot. And worked that next Tuesday. And that was on like a Thursday. So, yeah. And it's all good. And she called in saying, just like, hey, let you know that I did the automated system, that I have an interview. And since I have an interview at one, I just want to let you guys know. And when who answered the phone was the manager named Terry. For those who don't know. <laughs> what was that? Oh, that's mine. Right. But for those who don't know, her father that passed a few years ago is named Terry. And we're like, kind of meant to me, you know what I mean? Needing a job just kind of happened, you know, day of, that rarely happens. And it's higher than the minimum wage job. And so we're like, huh. And she goes in for her, like, wasn't it your first day? Yep. First day. He's getting her in the system, in the computer, you know, up front. And she said, babe, look. And he has a Black Panther tattoo on his forearm. And for those that know, no, but if not, then you will not. But Terry, her father that passed, also had a Black Panther tattoo on his shoulder. So we're just like, kind of low-key freaked out. Kind of low-key, like, what are the freaking chances of this, you know? But, she loves it there. She loves all the people there. You know, every every job will have that one customer. That, you know, just being a Karen, you know? So, my mom, she loves her job. She's doing great. She even came in Monday. Whenever she... Yeah, yesterday, whenever she wasn't even supposed to be there, she just, hey, you need me? I mean, I can come in. I'm there. And she, she helped her managers out because she knew she loves her managers, and they know that she needs help, and we're just nice like that. We're good. This is a good person like that. And so, yeah, so we just really feel like this is a sign that this is where she needs to be in life, and like, she needs to feel like, like her dad's watching over her and help guiding her. Like, you know, she like, got you. Everything will be okay. So, that is that update. I think I have one more update. Are you doing chicken right now? Yes, ma'am. Let's go over there real quick. I'll meet you over there. Okay, okay. Let's check out the pots. 
Nothing yet? We got the potatoes in there. Oil. Okay. Chef Dutton, what's going down in the bowl? Chef Dutton. Hang on a minute. I'm putting seasonings in here. What's going down? Okay. So since we're almost out of the Kentucky stuff that we like, I put almost put, ended up putting sugar in here. Oh, that would have no. been terrible. Anyway, I put some flour in there, pepper, salt, and this crap. This stuff's pretty good. Mrs. Dash. Uh -huh. Whatever the Dash brand's pretty good. I don't think that's all I'm putting in there. Of this in here since you like it so much oh yeah oh, oh, that smells good. this grease isn't guys this and eggs is a game changer just never had it before in eggs but let me tell you it's the way to be and then all i do after that because i don't want it to be too you know i don't want it to be I'm gonna be, uh, I don't want it to be too, like, salty or anything, so. Right. Or too, you know, seasoned up. Whatever the hell you call it. My brain's not fully working right now because I'm so tired. But, you do what you gotta do, you know? You're tired? Still get up and do what you gotta do. Drink a monster and have a great day. Yep. And people are like, oh my god, I can't believe you drink monsters. Fuck off, Susan, okay? I'll drink whatever I want to drink. If it helps me get through the day when I'm dragging ass because that's my Chinese disease, then <laughs> that's what I'm going to freaking drink. Alright, there's that. I got that heating up. Alright, the oil? Yes. Okay. A little bit above me. Lord have mercy on my soul. I have some eggs. Then it just escaped? Oh yeah. It sure did. We have any eggs? Do we not have any freaking eggs? Do we not? I don't know. Do we not have any? I don't see any. Ding, ding, ding. We don't oh, have any. No. Grease. Hmm. I'm gonna call Becky. Huh? Should we call Becky? No. You know what I am going to try? Huh. I'm going to try to do it with the eggs. You're going to see what happens? I'm gonna you try. can try water like shake and bake if that if it doesn't stick. I'm going to try. Because if shake and bake sticks, that should or, stick. Or what? What if you, like, I didn't want them to look at the camera. <laughs> what if you, like, oil? Like, oil brushed it? It'd be yeah. aight. I'm using water. We'll figure it out. If it don't work, it don't work. <laughs> If not, you know. It'll still get crispy. I mean, come on now. Yeah. Like, the skin will get crunchy. I'm not too picky. No. Food will be food. Around here, we cook and we eat. Who cares? It's food. Oh, okay, guys, look. And um, I want to hear in the comments, Oh, my God, you're doing this wrong. Because shut up. Do they have a name? Bubblegum-headed bitches. <laughs> I'm cut up towels. These are borrowed towels at the moment, but... These are our new bags. While you do that, I'm gonna real quick, real quick, guys, real quick. She took over these two shelves. So, yeah. Those are her new cat tree like shelves. Uh, oh, my nose out. itches. Huh? My nose itched. Not yet, buddy. Well, you want to tell them anything while we wait? See them in a little bit or something? Don't be a prick to people. That's all. Can see you in a little bit, guys. Bye. Okay. This is what's happening. Still bowling. And just put corn in, corn and butter. I'm gonna turn that. No, nope, I'm gonna turn that. Sure, over there. The water worked just fine, if you know. No, now you know. We got some leggies in there. You put the other back in the freezer. They're cooking. 
I just want to give you guys an update. We'll be back when it's done. Okay, guys, we're back. I think we're just waiting on potatoes now. Corn is done. Chicken's obviously done. It worked. And these are the chicken ones. Just kind of, they were just set on their way, but they worked. And this one got mangled, so I'm making sure it was done. Let's poke. Yeah. Sorry. I still need a little back. I'll roll you over. Pro tip, if it sticks out of the water, roll it over. Corn is done. Actually. Hey, did we put any sugar in the corn? No, it's okay. Um, put me some sugar. I'm making called a Yankee for doing this, but... I like me some sweet corn. And so it's just so. There's that. I already got this turned on so don't pop us. And here's our idea, guys. We're going to do mashed potatoes, like we said. But we got some pepper jack we need to use up anyway. We're doing cheesy mashed potatoes. We're hyped. So, yeah, all we have left to do is wait for these to finish up boiling and then we're done. And we'll see you guys in a little bit. Thanks for watching. Oh, wait. Let me see if I can find Jasmine real quick. You know where Jasmine went? Right here. With you? Yeah. Oh, perfect. Hi, Jasmine. I got her collar on, finally. She's so big. Uh, orange, white, and... I'm gonna go show you guys Teddy's cage real quick. Our room's a little messy, so like, mind your business. But, this is our rinky dink makeshift thing. We have cardboard all around the sides. But we're gonna eventually do this, and we're gonna fix it. Looking guys so far. I mean, her, all the pillow fell, but she was cuddling down in there. Got her set up in here. Scratch bones in there. comforter in the dryer. We gotta get out. Yeah. We'll see you guys in a little bit. Ha. Hey, here's how it turned out. That's not burnt. <laughs> That's shadow, but we don't have a light in here. Anyway. Corn. Sweet corn. Papa Jack's mashed potatoes. Fried chicken. Baby's over there. We'll talk to you guys later. We're about to eat some food. Anything to say? Okay, bye guys.